G'day guys, Ron here from Osborne Digital Marketing. Today I'm going to show you how to index a blog post in Google Search Console. Let's jump straight into it. All right guys, so as an example, what we're going to do is I'm going to grab a blog post and I'm going to place it in Google Search Console. So I'm going to walk you through how easy and simple it is. So we want to look at this, how does a, a small business uh, make its first sale. So this is a blog post that we've created and we've launched. So this is something that we can look at grabbing. Okay, we can we can grab this page. We want to get it indexed. So what we want to do is we want to come down to the permalink and click right here on the view post. All right. So once we have the URL, it's very important that we have the full URL. So we just copy that. Now we come over to the Google Search Console. If you don't have the Google Search Console, here's a video on how to install it. Very, very simple. You can have it installed in minutes and the power of this tool is incredible. All right, so now you have two options. If you copy that one URL, you can simply come up here and paste the information and hit enter. So now Google is going and looking to see what's going on with that page. It's, it's trying to look, it's trying to discover information. And because this blog post is up on Google, uh, fortunately we've been able to benefit from fast uh, indexing, you'll see that it's it's on Google. However, if it wasn't on Google, it would say that it's not on Google, it's not there. What you want to do is you want to come over and hit the test live URL. So what this does is the Google bots go out and start to crawl it and see what information is on that page. Perhaps you've got some errors on there. Perhaps you don't have any breadcrumbs. Perhaps you even have an FAQ. You want to see that the FAQ and everything like that's being picked up down below. So what's happening right now is that the page is crawling. It's getting crawled by Google. It's picking up all of this information. And basically what will happen is it will spit back what we already see. But it's very valuable for you if you don't have your page indexed on the Google Search Console then what happens is this will show you any errors, okay? So this just might take a minute or two like it's doing. So it's testing the page. So once that spits back, uh, we'll dive into that. But something else that you can do to help get your page index is you can actually submit the sitemap. So there's two things that you can do, and I'll explain this while this is testing the live URL is if, you, if we go down this method, we push the indexation of this blog post to Google. What we then can do is we can submit the sitemap to Google. So that's two ways that Google has been told by us. It's been informed that, hey, I've just created another post. Go and check it out. Here it is. I'm telling you to look at it. And here's my sitemap. It's now been updated. Google's more likely to go in and uh, check out that content if it's done. Now, as you can see, it's came back and again, like I said, it'd be all green arrows because we've got this indexed already. If you see over here, it says request indexing right above my head, simply click on that button. That's how you can, uh, that's how to index a blog post on Google Search Console. Now that that's done, I would go and submit the sitemap. I have another video on how, on how to submit a sitemap in Google Search Console. The link will be up above. Guys, if you've gained value, if you now know how to index the post, make sure you give me a like. That's a small favor and I appreciate it. And if you have any questions, just hit me up down below. More than happy to help. Have a lovely day. Cheers.